Fam, this is James. I'm um, just chilling out here in the sunset. Um, about to have have a little bit of a, a smoke break, some weed, and uh, you know, just wanted to record a nice little villain agent over here chilling out, um, acting like he's on the phone, but um, definitely um, here to annoy and to um, uh, 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 bother someone. Um, so just want to, I heard someone uh, just say conquer. Um, so, you know, um, just wanted to record this guy um, to show that, you know, um, they, come and, they come and bother you no matter where you're at, <laughs> no matter what you're doing, uh, especially uh, if you're relaxing, they, they like to come and, um, you know, um, take advantage of you or whatever. Um, and uh, I'm sure they have all sorts of excuses, but he's been chilling out here for the last, uh, I guess, 40 minutes or so. Um, so, you know, um, just wanted to record that and a beautiful sunset. Everything's all right. Peace and love. Just wanted to say a prayer with our brothers and sisters. Uh, things have been good. Um, and, I, you know, I just wanted to pray that, uh, you know, um, that we all, especially me, learn um, peace and um, patience, um, you know, uh, in this time of tribulation. Um, we have been, um, you know, uh, hurt for so long that we're going to have to go through some, some healing and some, some time to uh, adjust to our new surroundings and, and to the bodies that were stolen from us. And so um, it's going to take some time to, um, you know, deal with uh, the issues that are at hand. And there's plenty of issues. Um, so I just wanted to um, pray for all of our brothers and sisters and say, you know, keep the love in your heart. Don't forget, <laughs> um, despite all the trauma that has been impacted on you, uh, you know, it is an experience um, to be held. And uh, it's a beautiful thing, um, just like, uh, you know, the sunset over here. Um, you know, there are things that you just can't stop. There are things that take divine um, power and glory um, to, uh, to, to change. And uh, we are in that path of divine glory and power and strength and uh you know it's no longer our time and uh uh you know at, at least for me it may be other people's time you may be going through your own tribulations but for me um you know it's a time to chill and uh to heal and to relax and to um you know um maybe uh like a butterfly kind of <laughs> you know a, a caterpillar kind of goes into um it's um metamorphosis metamorphosis stage uh, I guess that's the term for it <laughs> uh, where it changes into a butterfly I'm not saying I'm changing into a butterfly but you know I've been through some trauma I've been through some things um, just like you know the rest of our family um, you know with animals um, the na nature the environment has been through some shit um, some stuff that's going to require healing and um, it ain't the way that nature works is that, you know, it, it, you're not going to just automatically upgrade yourself like you're a comic book character or like you're Superman or something. You're not just going to grab an orb and all the power is just going to come into your body. No, it's just not going to happen that way. Life does not happen that way. Um, there might be instances where you just, you know, come into uh, realization with stuff. But, you know, I like the slow... Uh, the snail slow <laughs> type of deal. That's honestly what I like. I like it slow and easy, um, easy peasy. And uh, I, I've been through some quick bunny rabbit, ridiculous shit. I have to admit, I've been through some stuff. And, um, you know, it, it was traumatizing. Because, and uh, it, it, it almost ruined me. And, you know, uh, that it depends on your, you know, your outlook on things. You know, some things... You know, some things are meant to be, and, uh, you know, we all have a choice of experiences to go through, and I feel that I made choices to experience some shit, um, you know, and, uh, you know, for the betterment of nature, for the betterment of this universe, betterment of, of my soul, so that I know, 
and I, I always asked, um, you know, I wanted the truth, and I got the freaking truth. Can you handle the truth? <laughs> That's what I have to say. I don't know. Anyway, so the gentleman, after I recorded him, has peace the fuck out. <laughs> um, and, uh, you know, and so I just, uh, I want to say peace and love, brothers and sisters. Um, we'll meet up at some point. I'm sure as we're going through our healing and our growth and up, upliftment, um, there's going to be some changes, I'm sure. And, uh, you know, more power to you. And I, I pray that, that you have sustenance and growth and happiness um, and uh, strength to, wave, to waver the storm if there's a storm or patience to chill when you need to chill um, so that you can heal and grow. Um, you know, just like someone who, broke, who breaks their leg. I've broken my leg. You don't just uh, jump on it <laughs> the day after you break your leg. You really are in a lot of pain and in, in suffering. And so you really have to um, heal that bone. The bone needs to heal. The body needs to get um, readjusted. And then after that, um, you need to learn how to use it again. <laughs> and so, you know, that's how kind of how things go. And, uh, you know, and it's, it, the bone may become stronger because of it. You never know. Or you definitely have gained experience on uh, how not to break your leg uh, or how not to do certain things um, so that you don't break your leg again. Anyway, so um, just a short video and um, just wanted to say thank you all for your prayers. If you're praying out there for each other, for nature, um, I'm praying for you. I pray for nature. I pray for its growth and its sustenance and its um, ability to, um, you know, to bounce back, its resilience. Um, and uh, we are giving that by the strength of our soul and our connection to the greatest one and the love that we share for each other. So peace and love, fam, and uh, love you all, and, uh, and uh, <laughs> have a good day. All right, peace out.